go. Right. Welcome to another Arctic Metals Coldcast. I'm here with Angelo. Hello. And Rachel. Hello. And I don't know who killed the person, people, guy. It's not FK. Actually, there were no Previously guys killing the yet, investigation. Right? I'm Jason. No dudes. Yeah. Thomas, did no, you see no me dudes. here? You're right. No. When I got here, he was already like previous. What are you doing? Get out of the way! I'll do it. George, stay back. She's trying to speak. Got us good this I don't time, think Nick Zach. Did it? It was the, the previously thing was insinuating that it was Nick. Hmm. Nick had like the explosion face. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, he just walked in dirty. He had black yeah. face. Oh god. <laughs> he would, Nick. <laughs> he would do it, yep. and he'd get upset at you for getting offended. Because this was made in Japan. <laughs> or black is, is okay. Yeah, it's a, it's a form of flattery. Oh, God. Yeah, did you know that? What, is that really considered a form of flattery in Japan? Yeah, people then like they, it, and then like they do blackface. Diane. That does not make it a okay. I've, I've only, I've only seen girls do it. Report. I don't think I've seen a dude do it. I haven't seen Major a dude Morgan. do it yet. But there's like a whole group right. of girls who are dedicated to yeah. it. Yeah. They make their hair, it, like they, they get that hair to that texture, too. Wow. Yeah. There's something yep. I'd like to talk to you about. I forget what they're called. Ex- ex- later. Ganguro. There yeah, it is, Ganguro. That's like an extreme form of cultural I'd like to go to a bar. Of course, we don't really have mm. to. The bar. Now that sounds like a good idea. Yeah, it's crazy. Zach, what do you think? So I just got invited to the bar by George. George. Or turn him down. Now I ask you, should I go or should I go? Well. That's not how the song goes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> well, I was gonna say, if you're gonna I be a bitch go. about it. You should go. Clearly, I should go. But if you, yeah. but, but if you're you wanna, you know, get something chick. good out of the story, you should Where go. You get so there's a zombie chick this? sitting at the table near Didn't us. Didn't I tell you? Look at the circles under her it's eyes. Not work. Oh my god. I got oh, it when I was a kid. Yeah. A childhood injury. Tree I almost thought he was like playing with somewhere. I used yeah, to I thought so too. Climbing the big tree in our backyard. Was playing on location. a lot. And fall out of it a lot. No, oh, yeah, she is like out of it. Oh, I missed. <laughs> this wasn't anything <laughs> like that, though. I was eating. Was my mother. His mother she gave him it. a scar. Was, I'm sorry, a, was his mother a bear? Don't worry. <laughs> it's ancient history. Don't judge. He's a very precise bear. He's only one claw. Violence. The strong overpower <laughs> the weak. Adults over children. Men over women. And criminals over their victims. It's a bear with a one claw paw. That's the name of a band if I've heard one. <laughs> yeah. One club. Have memories of my father. <laughs> he left before I knew him. That's a country band, right? My mother would hit me every time I asked why. Country bear band. Oh, I didn't stop oh there. I did it. I brought it there. Slow, left my shoes scared. Like country country bear. Yeah, the country, country bear. Too that too movie. She found reasons. That's a movie. Remember that movie? Yeah, the country bears. Huh. I think that's what it's called. The worst was what she called the. Well, they were a bear band. Punishment. Okay. This isn't a game movie, is it? Like oh my god. No? Okay. They're talking well, about like, child they're... abuse right now. Oh, really? Yeah. He's getting whipped by a, 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 a branch. Damn. Well, they already talked about, you know, rape before, so oh, child true. abuse. Tree punishment was Let's hope they don't combine the two. Just hearing those words used to make me shiver. That oh. want to pass Little it. baby right. George. Oh. That's why I didn't want god. to show you those scars on my back. Every time after the tree punishment, she'd always say the same thing. This is hurting the tree more than it is hurting. Or was that just the lighting? This is hurting the tree more than it's hurting you. Maybe she beat the blonde out of him. I went to the woods to apologize. How did it hurt the tree? If it's a dead limb. (laughs) The damage was already dealt. Yeah. Talk about insanity. I think it's I think it's George's mom that killed her. I kept asking myself. Why is she hurting me this way? Or it's actually George. I thought long and hard about George, it. George, yeah. a child. In the end, I just figured mm. I'm weaker than her. That's why. Right, because we haven't even seen his mom. It's the law of mother Did nature. Did come out of nowhere? <laughs> the strong eat the weak. But now, this game got you like have the power to protect the weak. Eat. 
That's mm. right. Or try to. Perhaps I should thank my mother for guiding me into this line of work. It does not know what tone it wants to set. Nope. It really reminds me of the room a lot that way. Oh my mm. god. Mm. York. Yeah. Nope. The doctor told me I had cancer last week. Fool, and, uh... <laughs> haven't I? <laughs> Never <laughs> mentioned again. Both Becky and Diane would still be alive. I could have saved them both. You know, it's almost like they died because of me. You're out of your mind. And now he thinks that the woman died because of him. I invited you to this bar for a drink. The twist is that they actually did. But I guess this bar <laughs> is my confession chamber. It's all your fault, George. I wanted you to listen. I wonder if that lady in the background is taking this murder really bad. You must. Maybe she's just really drunk. And that's why she's out of it. For causing all these problems. Maybe she might be the town drunk. Orders. Yeah. York. Yeah, maybe. But like, I'm almost sorry. the eyes. You don't get that I'll from being drunk. No, now meth, on. I said. Oh, you, you said meth? No. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, sure. George. I'm surprised she made her way to this uh, bar. She's the only person in you town who does meth. An FBI <laughs> to a bar for drinks. Definitely not. You see this you town? This is a meth hub. Town. <laughs> and the folks here respect you for that. Yeah, you're really fighting Nobody like meth heads in that alternate world. Oh Thanks. my god. Or you're really you on meth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're yeah, going to the alternate world. No, mm. it's both. Yeah. What a meth twist. on meth violence. Yeah, that'd be crazy. All right. Uh, I'm in a bar. Yeah, that's what it is. She's becoming one of those creatures. <laughs> <laughs> like, we're seeing it as it's happening. We should be keeping a closer eye on her. <laughs> She's gonna create problems later. Well, I can I can observe her. Just one of the regular patrons involved in the case, I figure. Yeah, just really, see if anyone else has it. Look at her eyes. <laughs> she looks like a raccoon. I wonder if they accidentally used her character model here. And she was supposed to be one of your enemies. I okay. Yeah, I wonder if they like ran out of yeah character models. They just so recycled like, it. Oh, I'm absolutely. Like, oh, just bring one of the enemies in here and clean Seriously. her up. Seriously, uh, Carol's over here. Who's Carol? Carol is hey, Carol. Tomas's sister. Becky is dead. What? Did they mention that? Diane. Yeah, too. at the town hall meeting. We've got okay. Nick in custody as a he was suspect. Like, what? I remember names. <laughs> Nick He's like very rude it? about it. He's uh, like, I don't believe this guy uh, has a I sister. Know. He's too much of a sister okay. to have a sister. <laughs> you took wow. a from That's Diane, good. didn't you? A locket That's with a... this mark on it. That's an interesting phrase. Mm. I, sometimes I don't say things in my head first, so I have no idea how they're going to come out. Oh, I know how that that is. Just listen to this show. I'm busy, gotta go. <laughs> Carol's about to sing. She's swinging her feet around. <laughs> Look at him, he looks sad. He's an FBI agent. The piano player also has really dark circles. Mm. Means it's spreading. <laughs> Meth is spreading. <laughs> Can't be a little outbreak here in this bar. <laughs> Maybe it's like a clue. Maybe this room is gonna be a dark room. And then you're gonna have to fight all of a sudden. Well, this place reminds me of when Cooper had that like memory of the tall man. Yep. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's what this is. You know, what was that bar called? That dinky little bar where they all met up. Their secret brotherhood of crime fighters. Oh, I was thinking. I was thinking the bar with. I mean, yeah, the bar where they had the uh, the Miss Twin Peaks pageant. Yeah, that's where. That that's happened. the same one where they. Yeah, had the same, oh, okay. there's only like three places they I go thought, to in that entire town. Yeah, that's great. I thought they went to like their own lodge, because no one else was there aside from the group. I, I guess think they. I think they could go downstairs. Time. Yeah. I think that was the only difference. It's like they, they met up upstairs, and then if it was open, guys, we gotta we gotta take this to the basement. Hmm. I wish the lip syncing was better. <laughs> I just think it would take away from this. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a kung f an old kung fu movie, right? Like, yeah. <laughs> it might not make sense if it matched up. I don't think it makes sense without matching up. <laughs> yeah, I remember just feeling odd and just uncomfortable. She doesn't enunciate her words. <laughs> Maybe she's a throat singer. The question is, <laughs> um, or for ventriloquism. 
Maybe that's what she's doing too. <laughs> she's practicing. Yeah. It's actually the piano player singing. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be crazy. <laughs> oh man! <Anyone laughs> Most have... versatile pi- plan, uh, piano player ever. It's, instead of people going like, "Holy shit! Look how much of a trick, how good of a ventriloquist he is!" They're just like, "Why is she such a shitty, shitty singer?" You know? <laughs> <laughs> or imagine this: like, this whole game is in uh, Morgan's mind, oh. and he's like vent- being the ventriloquist for everybody. Like, he's just imagining this world and, like, this danger and this investigation. In other words, he's in the grips of a very realistic delusion. Uh, Yeah. A realistic, persistent Uh, delusion. I have a feeling that I forgot something, Zach. What did I forget? I can't leave right now. Do I have to talk to her again? Carol? Yeah. I don't want to go through that (laughs) cutscene. Well, I know now you're waiting for Emily to arrive. I have to wait? Yeah, Emily's not there yet. I don't think you literally have to wait. Oh. Sorry oh. to keep you waiting, boys. He looks nice. <laughs> Did you see Emily? <laughs> Emily is already a ghost in the forest. <laughs> she is. It's beautiful. Let's forget work she for a bit and drink a little, shall dressed we? up for a bar. York. Yeah. I know, it's like, here? you guys, you want to go get some drinks after this? You know, Mary, after this Mary. horrible murder scene? Okay, I'm just going to go put on the loose. fanciest thing I own. She wants to, like, uh, show up the... The dead lady? Pardon the singer. Me. Like, oh. <laughs> I was all like, <laughs> okay, you thought she was hot? Sure. Look at this. I just got yeah. here and no, you're I meant, walking like, out on yeah. me? Yeah, I can see where I got a little soft crack. Dude, Morgan is going to begin it tonight. I'm afraid I've already had enough. Well, George is like, had a good as soon as she got there, he's like, I'm pooped. And I, I thought, so I'll when I first read it, I thought he was about to say, I gotta poop. <laughs> 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 Which would have been very interesting. To be honest, I've had people say goodbye that way. Well, I gotta poop now, so let's call it a night. <laughs> yeah. Yeah? Yeah, nights have gone, have ended like that. George Where were you going? Where were you? avoiding you all at the same time. I think it was like af- usually after <laughs> Rocky Horror Picture Show Fridays. There's a reason. And be like, hey, you want to go to Denny's? No, I got a poop. Into. <laughs> <laughs> we can't poop here in this honest. Denny's country. <laughs> it's like, okay, you do not have to come with us to Denny's. You are more than welcome to go poop in your own home. Yeah. Hey, okay. home is the place you can he did poop as long as you want. When I first home is where the poop is. <laughs> I was in high school. <laughs> <laughs> but I never really considered Wait, him. Wait, George type. asked Emily and out. There's the age gap thing too. I respect. But she was in that. high school. I wouldn't. Oh. He was like thirty. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> How old is he now? That mustache is starting to make sense now, isn't it? Oh God! Of course not. <laughs> I came with my parents. Mm. Tell me about them then. Sure, Every time I see not? his mustache, I think of that trucker hat that says like you know free mustache York. rides for the ladies. He was hardly <laughs> home when I was a kid. Wow. Always working. <laughs> I'm just gonna <laughs> shut up and keep eating, okay? No, that's cool. no, I want you to keep talking. This great. No, that's Which is good. no different now, really. I I don't see much of him. My mother. It is way totally inappropriate to get that dolled up that after expect. leaving a crime scene. Oh, it absolutely it, is. You know what? They don't. You know they didn't. They don't adequately not only that case those scenes at all. Me she might as well have just like shown him, like she naked right fierce, now. Too. <laughs> Well, no, it's not. Well, let's think of it this way. How many classy places sure. are in this town? All in all, she Maybe she wants to, you know... The art gallery? Yeah. Past tense. Mm. She's gonna dress up and go on the, yeah. the art gallery. Yeah, yeah where the murder gone. happened. Do you I think she's gonna go to. there anytime yeah. soon? Uh, yeah. She gave this yeah, to Look at how she's handling this situation. Yes, she's you obviously a person who's not going to do appropriate things at appropriate times. Do you know how good hors d'oeuvres can be made from human eyeballs? I'm sure she's very proud of you. From what, the crackheads? The crackhead eyeballs? No, the dead bodies. That is all there. them? So she's the murderer? That's why no, she's all, all I'm like. Not dressed saying, up. I'm saying Where she's are like. Where's either oh. of you going? I am so lost. <laughs> I don't know. Something's like Brendan's eating eyeballs. You're, you're obsessed with stealing eyeballs from corpses? Me? Yeah. No, I never said <laughs> You brought up all the eyeball things, and then I said, like, where are all these eyeballs coming from? Have them oh, and herbs. you're like, I need to know because it's so important. <laughs> then I was thinking the meth, the meth heads, I is their eyeballs. Today. Oh, this is beautiful. Brenda's like, mmm, eyeballs, gonna be wonderful of doors. And Angela's like, but where are you gonna get them? <laughs> <laughs> like, 
Where are you gonna find him what this time have? of night? What do you have like this time of season? <laughs> six right now? Because yeah. we have like three. Have no, two I mean, eyes. Like, there's three dead bodies so far. Oh, okay. Please. That's what I meant. <laughs> I was like, Stop no, being so self-centered okay. about your own eyeballs. I oh, wait. I gotta interject. Like, we have we have six right now. I'm like, no, alien. I'm... I have two. Well, I said we for one thing, so I could involve your eyeballs, my eyeballs. I thought you were like, you know, we as a human species have six eyeballs. <laughs> I gotta interject here real quick. Right. The bar is called Galaxy of Terror. Yeah. Ooh. Galaxy of Terror. <laughs> yeah. And the R doesn't work quite right. I, I, that's all I had to say. <laughs> wow. I don't know, like, what made them think of that? It's like... The owner of this establishment. Uh, Carol? The murderer. <laughs> Galaxy of Terror. That's a B movie. Sci fi. <laughs> it is. Probably. It, it better be. I'd be disappointed. <laughs> I'm trying anyway. to remember if it's if it might be because there was a movie called Planet of Terror. It was like a it was made back in nineteen late nineteen fifties, early nineteen sixties. Very corny but very good in a B movie sense. And I was wondering if that was supposed to be a reference to it. <laughs> Thank you, Detective Morgan. <laughs> How do I look at, like, my objectives again? The red arrows? No, I mean, like, what, I, what I'm doing. Like words? Yes, like an explanation. I don't know. I didn't know this game had that. I'm pretty sure you're going back to the hotel. Uh, I think you're supposed to listen. We're talking. Oh, yeah, I'm supposed to go to the hotel. Okay, good. <laughs> I remember Great this part. Guess. So the reason I was bringing up eyeballs... Yep. Oh god. Well, this is actually a really long exp explanation, but we have to drive away, so it works. Perfect. So I've been playing a multi-user dungeon uh, mm -hmm. based on the Discworld series of books. Long story short, it's essentially Zork as an MMO. If you think it like that, there you go. Text adventure with people. And, uh... I became a wizard in this MMO, because I'm a dork, and the thing is, so the wizards in this universe go to university and are like, you know, they don't kill people or anything usually, um, and I'm like a level one, and the spells that I get, I can, like, I can pull flowers out of the air and, and, and just do really dumb stuff. You're a birthday magician. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, I get an invite from like this epic level wizard. Uh, for a group called XP, and you know XP, good. I like XP. I'll join this group. And she starts leading me around the city, murdering everyone. Cool. There's like bandits around. You know, kill the bandits, sure. But then we get a group of nine old ladies, <laughs> just innocent little old ladies just standing <laughs> around, and she just like fireballs them, and they all explode. <laughs> and she turns to me and goes, "See these." Great source of eyeballs. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, who the hell did I group up with? Exactly. You joined a cult. Is there a command that you can pick up eyeballs? From yes, you have to hold a knife, and, and then you pick the body part, house. and then you cut sense. it off. And oh, man. And if you leave it too long, it will rot. Although you can get a spell that will let you pickle things. First, Becky gave <laughs> oh, that's cool. It will cool. last yeah. forever. That's crazy. I would pickle also, everything. Nick has no alibi for when Anna and Becky. And were those were those old ladies NPCs? We followed Nick to yeah. the gallery. Oh, okay. I mean, it doesn't matter. Like yeah. you can kill whoever you want. Victim. But like right. I was role playing up to that point the as like victim, a not Diana. bad guy. And she then this, the like there she's not role playing at all. She's just like getting XP. Her hands. Yeah. And so she's like, hey, hello, old ladies. <laughs> However, there was a You're all dead now. difference from the previous crimes. So crazy. Do you remember what that was? Is there, a, like, authority? No. No, <laughs> there's no authority in this world. No. <laughs> it's, uh... Wait, I don't even know what the question is. And I have three answers. Oh. Uh, multiple bodies. No, that's no? not it, Zach. Ah. Think back more carefully. What was, more what was different? Oh, what was different scenes? from the other crime scenes? Okay. Uh, well, no she was still alive when you got there. Was there a murder weapon in the other crime scenes? Oh. No, um... It was right after the crime. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, right after the crime. was still alive. This suggests I got, I that very little time has passed since the crime was committed. <laughs> okay. 
which means the criminal was still close by. It was someone near the scene. Why does he talk so slowly? There are two possible candidates. Nick, who was knocked out in the entrance, and one other. Who is the other? Zach, who was the other person in the gallery? The gallery. FK in the cellar. <laughs> that was a softball. That's right. Casey. FK in the cellar. We followed Willie. Look at that man. Good that sounds like a suspenseful thriller. Casey's how can he came be out a, as follows. How can he be a suspect, though? He and Diane were in a physical relationship. He couldn't have locked that himself That's why inside. he visited the gallery. Hmm. Oh, could he? in the middle of such a meeting when Nick showed up. Diane lost her cool. He has control over trees. We never actually saw what was in the basement. Maybe Casey there was like an exit. He was locked up. Yeah, it's there was a, a there is a window down there. That's how the dog got out. Ah. Wait, what did he hear? Did he hear a gunshot? He heard no. footsteps. Oh, he heard footsteps. What so that's Casey what it was. Here when he was locked in the basement. Yeah. All right. He heard footsteps. That's it. The sound of boots passing by. Heard your mom. Nick was wearing boots. <laughs> Zach, why are you so dumb? Which means it was likely <laughs> that Diane met with Nick in her room. Nick said he argued verbally with Diane about her. Oh, you totally picked gunshots. Nick, but they eventually decided you know, to go out drinking to make up. It was up. right before you said footsteps. Yeah, that was before. However, immediately after that, you should wait for a yay or nay, Nick boy. Was attacked by someone. He doesn't have time. And knocked unconscious. It's not that fast. Yes, fast it is. Enough. They saw the rest. I think it's like. Shorter than the delay, exactly. so <laughs> you can't see it before he has to pick. Okay, so I'm just gonna complain every time. Yes. What? Yeah, <laughs> makes sense. Who is your serial killer? And it's all faces of Morgan. Hmm. <laughs> Do you know who killed her? I don't know, actually. The tree. We all saw it. Asha sent in a report too. He found a large volume of red seeds. <laughs> what did you pick? Yes. Stomach. We just go with this. This confirms her as a victim. Of Maybe the conversation killer. would just change slightly. Maybe. Yeah. I don't think too much would happen. There's you say yes, and he's like, "Yeah, I know who it is position. too." And then it isn't like <laughs> the man. <laughs> Tell me. Back. Upside down <laughs> peace sign. There's a lot left to answer. It's the entire I town. The coffee will give us. Oh, well, they already got the report. <laughs> That's why they say they all stay inside because they're not actually in their homes. They're just like running around in raincoats. Mm. Oh my god! Zach, what did you think about George pouring? His heart out? <laughs> that would be crazy, actually. Yeah, <laughs> it's like uh, it's morning. like uh, Hot Fuzz. Yep. Oh. The Creator Good called me York. The Creator Good instead of Agent Morgan. <laughs> I love that moment. And I was like, it's all of you. It's all you. We <laughs> have to get the best town or whatever the hell it was. I don't remember the town. And a great big bushy beard. It's <laughs> <laughs> my favorite. Fascist. <laughs> Emily, what's going on? Stop. Do you know what time? Writing. I'm. I'm sorry. Oh, there's like no. I couldn't sleep, I couldn't so, sleep so, so I was drinking so alone. I was Emily says. Alone. Yeah. Morgan, do you not. What? She's sitting on my your sofa. A very kind one. <laughs> Should be on your bed. Are you talking to her smiles, about your so mother. Right. <laughs> cakes and cookies every day. And how she baked cookies She'd for you. that I needed the sugar because I spent so much time thinking. If Emily shows up tomorrow with cookies, it's a sure quiet. thing. Yeah. We never talked. It should be a sure thing a right now. Agent, like <laughs> I know, but you're talking about your mother, so. <laughs> Maybe he has yeah. a ritual. He but the naked cookies. painting behind you? Yeah. Yeah. And then Morgan is yeah. up, like, I guess the wall, just thrusting soft. Oh, no, he's good. Yeah, you know? Are you sure? I yeah. How many? She's taking them off. There are plenty of crazy things The painting. No, she's just holding it. I think she's taking them off. I think she is too. It's my job to make okay. sense. Okay. I think she's. I think it's like that model pose we have one thumb in, in your. I I think she's topless. Later that my father was I don't think so. I think she's peeling down a dress. <laughs> to catch bad guys. You know, because he so wants to peel down exactly Emily's dress. I think it's all. Like yeah, that's a, her hands aren't on her. That's a topless woman. Oh, can I ask oh. you? I see nipple. No. That's a nipple. Anybody watching? Is that a nipple? Mind if it's something. <laughs> oh, Emily's gonna ask us something personal. Do you wanna fuck me? <laughs> I fuck me. I fuck Zach. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she asked who's Zach. Zach. Oh man. Oh, Emily. I mean, Emily, you're breaking the fourth wall now, girl. <laughs> so you do have friends. Yeah. 
The painting's topless. Okay. okay yeah. yeah, I saw. Yeah. Yep. What yeah, kind of? I see it now. It's peeling. You see, it's peeling down close. It's getting. Na- it's in the process of getting fully naked. Okay. Well, I've never seen his face. He's never seen our face. But he's always with me, and we discuss everything. When did you become friends? A long time ago. Zach is an imaginary. When I was a child. No, imaginary oh. friend, not an imaginary child. I hope it's not a child. <laughs> hey, Zach, who was she brutally murdered? <laughs> Whoa. What the hell? I was seven. Maybe he's going for a pity lay. I woke up one morning to Dude. hear my mother crying in the living room. What? This oh, wasn't man. normal, this so is like I had in to see her. Oh, you're <laughs> upset about his childhood, yeah. That's sad. <laughs> my father was there his pointing father a gun at my mother. Pointing a gun at his I was so scared. I closed my eyes, so I, I don't remember much more. But I do I remember, remember the, the words, words my, my father, father said, said to me. To me. What a At times we used to <laughs> purge things from this world because they should not exist. <laughs> Even if it means losing someone that you love. I'm sorry. <laughs> so I inappropriate. Did you get to see the words dead. his father said to him? Yeah, because you're uh, gonna hear them mother. constantly. Sometimes we have himself. to purge the things that don't belong in this uh, world or something. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Close enough. Don't, don't worry about it. This world because they should not Zach's exist. with me. It was you around that time that we became that friends. Love. I'm here. I'm with you, he said. I'll be here always. So basically, we can get through this he together. had a schizophrenic break, and nobody's called him on it. Yes. <laughs> Quite aside from that terrible scene in front of me. That voice seemed Somebody to obviously calm. said, just let him go with it. Calmer. Hey, it makes him calmer. That's good. He'll work I it out. Yeah, hallucinations, yeah. As long as he's not telling him to kill somebody. Working together. Good. Yeah, not only that, he became, Getting you know, things. an FBI agent. This yeah. He's solving crimes. Instead together. of this. causing them. He might be causing them, and he's just solving his footsteps. Oh, or maybe. Or yeah. <laughs> that could be it. Covering his tracks. Sad story. She just said, I wonder if Zach will get angry. It's not a healthy way to be. I don't want you to take this the wrong way, but... I'm sure there was a reason. I'm sure there was a reason for what, for what your father, father did. did. Is Dad actually kill his mom? Yeah. Yep. I think maybe I became an agent to find Why? out. Why? There's no reason for that. <laughs> I think if his dad oh, was here right now, he'd oh, say, yeah, "You don't know work. me." I, I forgot to. <laughs> you don't know me. <laughs> Thank me. For what? You saved my life. Oh, but that's. I, I wouldn't say that to somebody who like my dad brutally killed him. I would have died. And then you're like, oh, I bet there was a reason for it. <laughs> no need to thank you for that. Well, I guess that's the difference in cultures then. Guess you shouldn't have nagged him so much, huh? I couldn't say huh? huh? What did you just say? No, that's useless. <laughs> can't kill somebody for that. Can you? I was never wait, wait, wait. expecting to hear you say What did Morgan that? say about useless? Huh. You might be a modest guy oh. after all. I thought he offended her, but finally you noticed. Okay. A little slow. I'm pretty... <laughs> then he called her a little slow. Maybe <laughs> hopeless, but not useless. <laughs> this conversation's all over the place. <laughs> and the music is too. <laughs> oh, he's in the bed alone. Do you think Emily got home? <laughs> Why did you send her home if it's like pouring rain outside? Anyway, Don't you know the raincoat more killer serious killed of a situation than I thought. Do you remember? Gosh. Our conversation <laughs> with Emily. Morgan, you're so bad at this. He told he's her really too much. Now there's an emotional attachment. He had a he had yeah, to get her get rid of it. Have certain feelings for you. Yeah, no. no, not his style. If that's the case, Zach. Because then he wouldn't hear the end of it from Zach. This is a very yep. serious situation. No, they're indeed. totally copying Cooper here because Cooper like had like multiple women just throwing themselves at him, and he's always no, just like. Comes to that. Let it be a fair fight. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did I ever tell you about the time that I drank black coffee? <laughs> Really good. The trees in this place. Thomas! Thomas! Let me out of here! Out of here. Come, on. Come on! I like how uh, Nick has a crazy Bon Jovi echo on his voice. Just a moment! <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sorry! I think I'm going mad! I'm going mad! I know you're there! Come on! Please! It just keeps going! <laughs> please, Thomas, please, Thomas, please, Thomas, he's big in Thomas to let him out. Thomas is the one that lost the keys to begin with. <laughs> Somebody should tell him about the wild squirrel. <laughs> 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 he 
He's only been in there ten minutes. He's freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> Thomas the tank engine barrels through the wall. <laughs> <laughs> we Thomases have to stick together. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, Dominatrix Dungeon, what is this? Would've been amazing. Crying in the Dominatrix Dungeon. Oh, there's it is not the, allowed. There's the symbol. Wow. What is happening in this game? Oh, man. You this good. just like, as soon as we hit that cutscene where he Big jumped off the balcony, this thing went off the rails. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, okay, well I made it to this part in the game, this whole long cutscene, it's a big moment. You get the bar, you, you know, you get a little bit of insight into George and Emily, you know, you and Emily finally make an emotional connection, and then they, they end that with, yes, your, your dominatrix slash sex dungeon. And that was like, I need to solve this crap. <laughs> uh, that moment. I no guess. many, th th there can't be any more women lost Episode. to this sex dungeon. <laughs> Episode 3, Tea Break. I have four doors. One in each cardinal direction. Which way should I go? It's a more door. Uh, that was your question. Yeah, mm. I, I don't know. Oh, okay. You don't know? Let's go. Anything different about them? Let's go east. No, they're all the same. You sure? Yes. How sure? <laughs> uh, sure enough that I went east. Then pick a well, damn door. One of them has a plant next to it. What? Yeah, there's like a plant in front One of it. One of them had a plant like in front of it. Well. I don't know if that's a... Is it too late? Oh, cute. oh, you're right. There is a plant. Okay. I'm reminded of the water dungeon in Ocarina of Time. And you go to the place where you fight the Shadow Link. There's oh. a mirror room that just goes on forever. And then you have the worst boss battle of all time. Oh, that was so fun. No. <laughs> no. No. Oh, how'd you find it? It'd be better if it was like Psycho Mantis or something, but you just have to pull out the Megaton Hammer and you're like, oh, you're dead. Oh, but that's not the fun way. He blocks all of your shots if you don't. What am I doing? That's when you have to be better at countering. Well,. I was a child. Okay. Oh, what? What the? F Who is this? Why is Colonel Sanders in my game? The <laughs> <laughs> game is hacked, bro. <laughs> now, let me tell you about my eleven secret Who's spices. <laughs> no! Oh, hey, it's the guy with the gas mask. Uh, what if I don't want to go? Uh, I don't want to restart this section. I do. Yes, I'm going. It's better than staying here. Very well. Off you go, Mr. Mark. Make sure to try the crispy chicken. What is that? Like, things for a stoma? I'm to breathe. That's what, so. It's called a stoma, right? When you have a hole in your throat? I like I, how they, they put the shadow... Sure. You'll see in a sec, but they put a shadow Love over the father's face. I know that's like a common like At anime times, thing, but it reminds me so much of Phoenix Wright right now. Because they should not exist. Uh, which none of you have played because you jerks. I'm going to. I said <laughs> no. We had this conversation. I'm yes, gonna get did. the collection and play it on the 3DS. Yes, Excel. we did. But Is it out yet? No. Okay, well then shut up. <laughs> I'm just saying. This is totally Phoenix Wright moment. As soon as it comes out, you can send me a text every minute until I get it. Whoa! <laughs> Mom is a zombie. Oh yeah, look how pale she is. It, it was a loveless marriage. Oh hey look, Grandpa Morgan. <laughs> and then okay. I murdered my mother with a spoon. <laughs> For her eyes. All Escapism Morgans murder. All Morgans murder their wives. <laughs> Did I ever tell you about how your grandmother died? <laughs> <laughs> I used a fork at that time. I said, Grandpa, please stop. <gasps> oh, God, the glasses and the pictures are...
Your mother died from the tie that's on your teddy bear. <laughs> from a poorly timed erotic game. Ugh. It happens. Look it up. Uh, I know. <laughs> horrifying. Doesn't seem worth it, really. I mean... No. I mean, it has to be really freaking good for you to, like, risk dying, right? Yeah. 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 And not even just dying, but, like, dying in the worst way possible. Is that the worst? Way possible? I don't know. Maybe, like... Like, what could be worse? Well, if it's your loved one looking into your eyes, and all you think is, you're doing this to me. That that could be a pretty vengeful, angry way to go. Oh, my God. That'd Mr. Be Morgan, like a movie. do you want a refill? Yeah. Yes. Oh, Thank maybe you. you know. Brendan, I got this I got this line, right? And it's stuck in my head. And I love it, because it's such an intense... Good, if somebody says this to you, you're like, oh, Coffee, shit. Vital, it's, I can't remember where I heard tool. it from, but it was like, I want to see the lights it's leave your eyes. To do now. That sounds so familiar. Right? Oh you remember my God. that? And I'm thinking, I'm like, okay, th that that person really wants you dead. Harry in the coffee circle. But no, I don't know where that saying comes from. It says to hurry. I was like, oh, is hurry. that an answer? Or... I know, yeah. line is <laughs> H-A-R-R-Y. Oh, okay. Hurry. Hold on. Do you have a rule that apparently? No. The time that he was talking about has Harry come. Potter, someone said. Come is it really a Harry Potter? Dramatic rich boy who owns half of the town. Morgan is seriously a paranoid schizophrenic. Like yeah. he Polly, has auditory hallucinations. I think I'm going to go see he Harry today. Sees patterns and things that. Oh really? Don't. He's no, a little cool. strange, but I, mean, I think he's the I most like the mystery. one If he wasn't here. an FBI agent, he'd be one of those people in a room with, with like. If you say so, Legos all over the wall. Then we probably will. <laughs> like circle oh, things with like pins. You know, but he has to do that for his job, so it's like it looks coffee. normal. Yeah. He's he really that guy. He is crazy. <laughs> really has I'll like a serious later, psychological disorder. <laughs> it's just going unchecked. Yeah, because he does his job with it. Yeah. Mr. Morgan, what about the coffee? Don't you want to refill? Well, technically, your you're allowed to be unstable as long as it doesn't interfere with your job. Yeah, or your, well, yeah, your job. But I mean, the definition of like abnormal, like, like if you're to have an abnormal psychology, I guess, your or abnormal mind, like it has to <laughs> affect your life in a bad way. Yeah. That mm -hmm. will, like you, so you can't like live properly. Right. So if you're a type of person who draws on the wall with poop. That's that's and you good. can somehow make it work into your life. Oh, you, like you become an artist. Yeah, exactly. There's, there are artists. Okay. There is one yeah. artist that draws that only paints with their feces. There was uh, three years now. Uh, what's his Diane, name with the melty woman, so watches? It shouldn't be a problem. Dolly. Uh, that's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah Salvador, yeah. right? Dolly? Yeah, Salvador yeah. Dolly. Yeah. Later so on, he started Diane. like painting with poop. gosh. Did did you find out who did it? Oh yeah. I, can't I don't know why. That. Yes. I'm, I'm pretty sure he was sick later on. Something happened. You don't have to yeah, did he get sick? Yeah, yeah. I, I think he had like some sort of degenerative so no, neurological. <laughs> it was probably so syphilis. syphilis. Would do that. It, it has sure taken down many a many great men. Nothing to be ashamed of, right? Nietzsche fell down. The, to worry the syphilis. About? That's when he started nothing hating hookers. <laughs> no, nothing at all. I'm clean. As By the way, the mm -hmm. I just realized the plant that FK is carrying around is grown from one of those red seeds there, isn't it? Yeah. That's a red plant. It grows What's from red seeds. Yeah. We don't have a problem, yeah. right? Uh, yeah. Doesn't that make him, like, the number one suspect? One would think. You would, yeah, you, you'd think so. I mean, red plant. That's too guy easy. shows up. It's too easy. We can only too easy. Isn't Emily. Orange plaid shirt. <laughs> I'm like just how, saying, I've never seen orange plaid shirt. I like how Kason walked away, and then the cutscene ended, and then he's right back sitting down. <laughs> <laughs> Continuity error. Maybe he realized he doesn't like walking. And he came back and sat down. Yeah, maybe he went to get something and then come back. I got extra money right, for checking no. the weather. He's no, he's all over the place. He was in the couch, he was on the couch, never mind. There was an egg in the microwave. I don't think you're supposed to microwave eggs. Usually. I do you it. can do it. Right? I do it. 
I know. I've heard. Of I like don't think they taste the best when you do it. Bloating eggs, put. if you migrate. Well, oh, you mean like in the? Yeah, not in the shell. I was gonna say if you want to keep it <laughs> no, from that, exploding, poke was, a. Oh, sorry. You're supposed to take like a a needle and, and poke a hole at the top. Maybe that's what they did. You're yeah. welcome. Where oh, you no, so my, my dad microwaved an egg in the shell once, and then oh, went yeah? to go crack it open. Or like he did something, and it like just exploded Yo, onto his skin and caused burns. <laughs> oh, no, man. Have, so, have you tried the radio? I've never I've microwaved been trying, an egg. But he's not answering. After that story. Very horrible, me? but at the same time, I wanted no to problem. see it happen. Yeah, <laughs> I want to be like egg bomb. He's still saying <laughs> that'd be amazing. Just microwave eggs and you throw them at people, and there's a perfect little egg bomb. Yeah, the perfect. He kept calling for him, but Thomas stopped responding. Uh, remember that video I showed you way back when called the Easter Bunny Hates You? The guy oh, running around. Thomas. What? <laughs> I tell you this terrible story about my dad. Sure, and you're like, oh, that sounds like a great idea. Let me just microwave all of these eggs and throw them at people. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, it's interesting. Okay. As far as I know. <laughs> Thomas, I, I, I just, astounded. I like science. <laughs> I'm sorry. I like science? More like you like hurting people. <laughs> what the hell? As far as you know, there haven't been any serial killers Alright, then don't look up the video, Easter Bunny hates you. That's right, but that's not... But seriously, best Emily, Easter video. Emily, I'm going to see Harry today. <laughs> what? Emily's like sticking with her butt out and stuff. We have plenty of other Gosh. leads to follow, don't we? But why not? She already had our kids out. Over, though, right? It would be bad manners not to accept. <laughs> Being very well, she is, painting, not her. Really <laughs> she is just agent? asking for it. Am I, I right, Rachel? The FBI would take a more mm -hmm. logical oh. approach to investigations. Like I, I'm offended that she Syrian came to the hotel room stay within the and, and, and now she thinks she can dress like a sophisticated Thus, career woman. I mean, she's, I know, she's right? starving. Right. She's starving for some York That's peppermint right, patties, if you know what I'm saying. She's holding out. Yeah. Holding out. Okay. She wants to get the sensation. The carrot in the stick. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> what? It's carrot in the stick. Uh, Reward and punishment for thinking you might be. Oh, okay. Pick. Yeah. Oh. I really need to work get on the my carrot. She, she did. I mean, she was gunning for him, but now she's like, I'm an idiot for liking him. Yeah. <laughs> More see? again. She's like, what was I thinking? All that alcohol and cleavage. So is that it? Is that it for Morgan and Emily? Is it? Is it? I mean, come on. Girls are like, oh my god, I'm so stupid if I <laughs> like him. Face. When has that ever stopped? Is that face? Anyway. <laughs> 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 she, like, disgusted herself. <laughs> it's like turning into a pirate. <laughs> so I could go to lunch right now, but I'm all full up on food. So I'm just going to skip that for now, I guess. Mm. And maybe after the first mission, you will be able to eat. I guess. Oh, where are you going now? I don't know. Oh, going to see Harry? Harry we're down to Harris. We got all your sorts of serial killers and uh, associated merchandise. <laughs> like serial killers and yeah. Whatever goes with that. <laughs> Corpses, mostly. You mean paraphernalia? That's like serial killer weapons. byproducts. <laughs> Terrible artwork. <laughs> Letters from prison. Cult followers. <laughs> Meth hands. We got it all. <laughs> Come on now, the hairy old serial killers are us. You kill for these prices. <laughs> nice. <laughs> there should be a store that only sells breakfast cereal called <laughs> Cereal Killer. <laughs> oh, that'd be awesome. No, there should be like a cereal brand that really takes off on that idea. Yeah. Like you put you put milk in it and it turns red. Oh, oh. man. <laughs> That'd be great. It comes like that so actually milk. would be a great twist on uh, Count Chocula. Hmm. Because he's a vampire. Yeah, they were, they were too pussy about it. Yeah. I mean, it's for kids and all, but like, you know. Yeah, you, you can make a different uh, vampire. Yeah. You mean make a real vampire? Yeah, a real vampire. <laughs> yeah, a real yeah, vampire. sure. No thanks. No thanks. <laughs> He'd have like sparkle flakes. Oh, sparkle Ew. flakes? Is that yeah. a, is that a <laughs> copyrighted uh It could term? be. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> but uh he would have a it. Cereal company. It is now. <laughs> and our patented sparkle flakes. 
<laughs> Warning, they may or may not cut your roof of your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> it's like pieces of aluminum. <laughs> oh, Jesus. But see, we would like swiftly get rid of uh, the Twilight fandom, so there you go. Yeah. At least you'd be able to see them coming when they open their mouths. <laughs> <laughs> you can't already? I guess you have to wait an extra second to actually hear the words come out. Yeah. Man, I'm making really topical them. jokes. <laughs> Isn't nice. We should make a cereal based off the Hunger Games. It's an empty yeah, it's box. called an empty cereal. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> or it's just like a fucking bow and arrow, a tiny bow and arrow in a box. It's like, kill your own food. <laughs> oh, yeah. Kill your brother, mail in his hand. Oh, God. You know how you have to, like, usually... Like yeah. box tops? Yeah, you have to yep. collect a whole bunch of box tops. You yeah. gotta collect fingers or something like that. Or eyeballs. Mm. And mail them in for a rebate. <laughs> In the description for this episode, I'm just going to put eyeballs with no explanation. <laughs> Actually, our most viewed video is the one that I put, like, pickled doorknobs. Oh, really? I don't know why. <laughs> like, nonsensical descriptions make people very interested. Makes sense. I'm not going to lie. I, I don't even remember what that episode was about, but I want to I wanna watch it. You don't remember? Like, pickle. Oh, pickle. Uh, and doorknobs. Oh, yeah, and remember we talked crazy. about the... Colored pickles. Yeah. And the the doorknob ladies. Sounded racist. Those <laughs> colored pickles. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> colored pickles only. <laughs> wow. Completely out of context. Great. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> but the doorknob la ladies, remember? Miss Dangerous Situation. Yeah. There's another episode. Where a crab suffocated her. Wait, what is this? <laughs> yeah, about that one. Yeah, do you remember oh. that? Like, she was like, oh, my friends are coming over. Oh, well, she better, you know, hurry up and get in that crab prepared. And she pulled out the crab and she didn't put it in the water fast enough and it jumped at her face and it wouldn't let go. It just hooked on. And she's like, ah! And Wait, they're no, like, seriously. oh no. What is what? this? <laughs> Miss Horrible Situation. What's that from? It was, it was like a sh They're Japanese a short? shorts. Yeah, the Japanese oh. shorts. Or this, it would just die in weird ways. Ah, or okay. be terribly injured. I, yeah. I I think it was like a what not to do? Yeah. Mm. Maybe? I don't all know, right. but she did all the wrong things. I think she also had like her vacuum cleaner on and the TV was on. And she tried answering the door for her friend. It was just, she's not smart. Yeah. Oh, right. remember the exercise ladies who were supposed to teach you English? Yeah. I got robbed by two men. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, all the English they learn is how to tell English-speaking cops that Americans were up them. <laughs> <laughs> we're at Harry's mansion. I saw that. Mr. Well, like, Francis, you almost slipped your car over, man. Finally, you have a uh, Yeah, like, well, 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 to come okay. inside. Mr. Francis, you're Oh, man, we're already at the mansion? Holy crap. It was only chapter three. Oh, Wait, you? we're in chapter three now? Isn't that what you said? Oh, I forgot that I said that. You said that at the beginning of the episode. We finished chapter two and you said it was one of the longer ones. Yeah, but I also did a lot of missions in chapter two. I also completely forgot that I could use the car radio. <laughs> Whatever. Well, you so, couldn't use it to Harry's because you haven't that's been there. That's true. But to the hotel, I could have. Oh, yeah, so you just wasted your own time. You no. wasted everybody's time. Mm -hmm. Do you have gas? <laughs> that uh, actually, no. I, <laughs> Mr. Francis York. I farted earlier. Mr. Stewart oh, has good. been waiting for you. I might burp. To the meeting room. Yeah. You shall go. I'm gonna try and suppress Just it. Make it a belch. Yeah. Oh, I could. Be very good for this. Get me a soda. <laughs> I can belch the national. Something anthem. carbonated. <laughs> oh, he's gonna play the piano for us while we belch the national anthem. Okay, I, I just want you to. You know, as you're getting into this mansion, imagine having to live here. The meeting. Okay. You do that for me. All right. Like this Resident is Resident what you have to come home to sincere. all the time. Okay. 
Oh, I like how he's listed as a suspect. <laughs> Doesn't he have a name? <laughs> yes. All right. So the 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 front ante room has like two crazy busts, a bunch of paintings, and six sofas, six leather sofas for a man who is in a wheelchair. Uh, yes. Let's go into the next room. Not only that, but did you notice that this room rotates? Is it the room? I actually missed that. I thought it was something else. I thought that was that platform. I right? thought it was, yeah, I thought it was a platform as well. Not the whole room. You guys will see. Uh, <laughs> there's a roped off door and music. Well, it just makes sense now. Does he have chamber music group? Day? Probably shouldn't get into the roped off room. Is this a museum or a house? <laughs> Just read your points of interest. This is a special needs house. This is what they all look like. This is a payphone in a house. <laughs> uh, I told you, this is a home. Think about having to come home to this. If I go in the meeting room, will I be able to explore after? You should always explore beforehand. Don't All be right. silly. But there's a lot of rooms. Yeah, it's not that bad. It only looks like a lot. Besides, you 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 think it's gonna be that easy to get to the meeting room? Um, we have a bed, which makes me think there's gonna be a nightmare scenario. I can shave off my glorious beard, but I Why wouldn't would be a man if I did that. Uh, umbrella for guest room number four. What? Why am I stealing umbrellas? <laughs> Why wouldn't you? I'm not going to do that. There, I must. There must be like an intricate lock that requires umbrellas, unless that's like a, a weapon. Tell me, is it a puzzle thing? Yes. All right, let's go check out the. You should room. know better. I hate like picking up all the puzzle pieces before I see the puzzle. I like it. it yeah, I me. do too. Cause it's because it's like, ooh, what's this? Like, what, you find something weird and you'll pick it up right away? Because that's better than having to backtrack if, if it's like a long backtrack. I'm just saying in real life, if you find something, it's free, it's been left behind, and it's interesting, you grab no, it for later. Here's the thing I was about to say. In real life? In yes, real life, a, I would not pick up that umbrella. Free? Because, yeah, exactly, this isn't his home. And yeah. it's like he can hide an umbrella. Yeah, All right. right. It's okay, like we haven't your... left the house with it yet, so it's not <laughs> stealing. Okay. What is holding it? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You're just walking around the house with the item. It's like if I walk into your room and it's like, oh, look at this movie, and I held the DVD and walked around your room. Are you a little suspicious? Yeah, but you're not gonna say anything until I go to leave. That would be incredibly annoying. <laughs> it would. Just thinking about anybody doing it to my stuff, and I just. Oh. Yeah. So, but you allow it. If yeah. You do it. No, I'm not gonna allow it. I'm oh. just... I'm gonna do it. Compare it to real life. I'm just like I can back it up. I think. <laughs> Depends. All is there armed security? Rooms. Why isn't this the hotel? Yeah. I know it's so much nicer. What? How do, does he hold like eyes wide shut banquets here? Like what is this? <laughs> uh, you know. Oh, oh, I think he does. Probably does. He's a pipe. That's what rich people do. They have really weird sex. <laughs> <laughs> what am I gonna do with all my money? Have really weird sex. I'm sex, trying to think like is still missing. So that must be really expensive, right? Huge orgy. Because you probably gotta uh, cater it. Oh, absolutely. That is imagine yeah. if you were in the caterer, like, you know, that's just your job. <laughs> you, you, you cater like, you know, normal uh, shit and then it's like, hey. We got an orgy gig here. <laughs> do they do they actually Get caterers for these? I thought they would cater themselves. Zach, something is still missing. No, 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 no. I need no, more no. clues. You can't handle food after you've been, you know. Well, I figured they would have like basic foods out. You know, no, like a snack and... bar. Zach, okay, I would not missing. want that. Eat like, a Snickers. Mm. Should you would use it during? I know, but I I would not want that because everybody's, you know. You wouldn't even thing. go to an orgy in the first place. Zach, That's so stupid. <laughs> I might still, I might still get the food. I'm not gonna participate. <sighs> Right. Maybe I'll sneak in as the non-existent uh, catering staff. Okay, but all I'm saying is that these people are, I'm guessing, touching, using their hands, right? And not wearing gloves when they're touching things or doing things. I, I, and if there's finger foods and they're reaching in, you know, you know you don't want to touch anything that was next to what that person just grabbed. You're, <laughs> you're a part of an orgy already. I don't think those are the issues. 
Mm. They should be. I don't know. Just I want to eat uh, anything just because, at an orgy okay. period. If I ever, I want to go to one, but like, it's just a bad idea. You know, eat, <laughs> bring a bring a bag lunch. I really. feel it's like a, because you know it's a bad box. idea. That that knowledge is what makes you not a person who goes into orgies. But see, knowledge is half the battle, as I've okay. learned from GI Joe. All right, here's so, my yeah. thing, right? Yeah, I'm guessing here. All right, I don't know anybody who goes to orgies. I met one girl, but she said they were very minimal. But basically. An individual going to an orgy, I'm guessing they don't want to screw everybody there. You know what I mean? mean? So yeah, they might be okay right. touching the soiled food of, yeah. you know, the few people they have been involved with. But if they see the creepy guy that's been over in the corner just kind of watching everybody and he goes to touch them, you don't want to touch something then. So wait, so what would a caterer do to change this? They'd be walking around with the trays. So they'd have limited amounts of food, right? And they'd be replacing, you know, they'd be refilling the trays instead of having people contaminate all the food available. But that sounds like a lot of food is going to be wasted. No, no, because it's going to the food's on little plates, right? I got yeah. this. I'm playing this out in my head now. And now I, now rich, I know how to cater an orgy. In if, case. You're, if you're rich, you don't care about wasted food. They waste food for fun. Well, no, no. There's a way to right, do this yeah, without wasting true. food. You have you have like little serving plates, and everybody if they want the food, they got to pick up the plate. <laughs> they got to pick up the plate. Yeah. You just got to do a lot of dishes. You, you then put it on the back of your partners. Yeah, exactly. Right. Why do you? I don't think they're gonna pick up the plate. They're gonna pick up the food on the plate. They're gonna pick up the plate because the food's on there, and that's the rules. <laughs> so, no. Yeah. I don't think so. I'm I'm enforcing it. So I think this became the best episode of this we've ever done. Uh, wow. Yeah, I think you have to change the title now to this. Um. <laughs> Something involving orgies. Never eat food at an orgy. Yeah. Catered orgy. No, I'm holding to my bag lunch here, you know? <laughs> you really gotta eat. But, like, I didn't even think that they would have food at orgies. I would think you'd eat beforehand. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe well, just... no, I, I was specifically talking about, like, eyes wide shut, right? Okay. It's like some fancy ballroom shit, you know? Yeah. With, like, the masks and stuff. Uh... So I have six umbrellas. Zach, something is still missing. <laughs> three statues. We need more clues. He's ready for an orgy. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> uh, what umbrella means? Why do you think you have six, Brendan? Uh, Zach, something is still missing. <laughs> oh, no, he's worried. He's like, oh, no. I'm not prepared. There's probably like a secret button somewhere, and that's how uh, Mr. Stewart doesn't have to do all this. The, um, no, like, I, bet I thought you piano. meant, like, this is all red herrings right here. Like, I just picked up umbrellas for no reason. <laughs> yeah. Um, wait, are these in, like, the wrong room? And I have to go put them in the right room? I don't know. What? There's nothing here that makes sense, because I can't interact. Like, every time I try to put an umbrella on the statue, it's like... What are you doing? Yeah, it sounds like it's missing something else. They're yeah. numbered. The statues aren't numbered. I liked them. No, the umbrellas. Look at the umbrellas. I know They're they all are. different. But like, yeah, but the statues are all the same. So how do you compare? Which one goes where? Well, there was something that Brendan passed earlier. There was a music piece. Ah. Uh, okay. <laughs> why would I? Why? That doesn't make any sense. Three five six. All right. Three five six. Three five six. Thank you. That's all I needed. <laughs> See? Hey, this is a dumb puzzle. This is worse than any. You know, this is the actual mansion where Resident Evil took. Essentially. Mm, it looks like one of the ones. Oh, Resident Evil used to stress me out because, like, oh. Well, if you don't grab this piece now, you're not going to have room to grab it later. Yeah. Oh, my God. Is that how you'd feel at an orgy? The food. <laughs> I, know, I just can't get over how uncleanly an orgy must be. Yeah. Right. Which is why I thought that they didn't care about food germs. I just feel no. like there's a lot of things you got to take into consideration, right? I mean, I, I'm, I'm assuming since they're rich and, and healthcare and all that, that they're disease-free. But what about pregnancy? Well, I would assume people who are into that are in birth control. Right, yeah. It's not 100%. Uh, they would also, like, 
at a well organized uh like everybody would be using uh rubbers yeah either that or that like a... if they're all if they're all rich then they know what they're doing i guess but no <laughs> but that's actually money doesn't equal knowledge that's apparently like a no i like... mean like then they they know how to take care of it if they get one and i don't think they're trying to get more money if they are uh all right. So you're saying it's not a welfare scam? There's probably life. like, there's probably like also like some, what is it like, like a contract, something like that. You know what I mean? Going into it. Like you know, you can't, you you can't get any paternal. Like you tests. can't fuck over other people other than in the literal sense. Okay. Well then, let's have a tea party. Don't <laughs> <laughs> only follow that up with tea. I can't believe we just talked about that for like 10 straight Mr. minutes. Mr. Francis, you are not. <laughs> <laughs> was it, it wasn't that long, it was it? Hot. Too much yeah, coffee long. for this... your body will make it rot. Too you much coffee well in your body will make it rot. Almost as though wow. you knew I would be coming today. Is that true? Mr. Stewart is so says Mr. about Stewart. the best timing for oh, all man. Obviously somebody doesn't that have to wake up in the morning and go to work. I know, right? Or be a college student. <laughs> <laughs> that takes oh, both sorry, day and night much. classes? Come on. I just on. don't like tea. Well, how much is too much, also? Uh, I have a friend who drinks, like, six cups of coffee a day. That might be too much. And that she, might... like, she drinks one to go to sleep. So... Oh, oh, I do that. I think yeah. her, Mr. Francis, her body has been taken over by caffeine. Some tea with sugar. I mean, like, for his standards, to make that statement, how much is too much? By your body like, is he meaning even so if you take tired. one a day? That's too much in the long run, or no? He would have said that. He's like, he would have said. He's not gonna go. He, he would have said, said coffee rots the body. Period. If, no. Yeah, I mean, if he said there's too it's, much, if it's, there's obviously a minimum. If you know, if it affects in the <gasps> long. Run. Red seeds and the sugar. Where did you get these seeds? Oh, dude, it turned into a bastion soundtrack. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Also, uh, coffee rocks your body. Is totally a 90s hit. Really? No. Oh. <laughs> but it could be. Yeah, I almost looked that up. Coffee, coffee, I know, right? Coffee, 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 coffee. Right? It sounds like it. Yeah, no, it's like Salt and pepper, probably. More seeds it could be in like some, some uh, dance you program now. Some lady. Space. Coffee. Come back to it's what they play when they're closing for the night. After you find that sweet, sleep, drink, coffee. <laughs> <laughs> What happened in the Bastion music? Harry, so you would like to play games? I heard you liked it. <laughs> At first I thought it was like they're, t like they're singing about a wall. Oh. So they that Mr. wall Francis is going to fall. A hint for you to find it's this location. <laughs> it is most crowded and most quiet. And oh. A cold oh, I met a guy today who has so ice cream every night before he goes to sleep. Oh, I thought you meant like he gave you ice cream. You're so really you're excited to tell to us. I, know. I was. <laughs> I would have been way more excited if that was the case. No, he said every day for the past 20 years. Whoa. He Is eats he a overweight? bowl of ice cream every night. It's the only way he could go to sleep. He said. Wow. Is he fat? No. What? Not even. Does what? he eat that instead of having actual food? He's got No, he eats all day. Damn. See the flash? I didn't ask. <laughs> Is he bulimic? It's crazy. It's that's uh, no. That was in bad taste. No. Oh, that's good for him then. I was talking. He was telling me this, and he and he had like two hot dogs covered in mustard and banana peppers. Yeah. I forget where we were talking about exactly. to get there, but we got there. Again. Do you guys like hot dogs? I hate hot dogs. I like hot dogs, nice. but not all the time. Yeah. Um. I'll eat like Nathan's. You figured it out, Zach. Oh, Nathan's is good. They're quality. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Every other hot dog. Graveyard. Yeah. There's lots of people okay. there, but none of them can speak. I can see that. You it see? has a particular taste. So it it is, you know, ground up extra meats and ends and excrements, in probably. <laughs> yeah, that's what it sounds like. <laughs> extra meats is very close to excrements. <laughs> well, uh, there is a minimal amount of that in most hot dogs. Uh, absolutely. Yeah, remember the FDA, FDA allows it. You can't have more than a certain percentage. Yeah. And, and, and bugs? Yep, bugs, yep. rats. Other Oh, assorted. I think that's okay, because, I mean, you can... 
in some places actually serve rats. Uh, uh, rats. Why, yeah. why don't we eat rats more often as a people? Because we use them for science. No, I mean, we also use, like, other animals for science. But not as much as rats. Yeah, but I mean, you just don't eat the science rats. Like, there's <laughs> plenty of rats. You don't want to eat the science rats. No. They're testing those things to yeah. shit and back. You know? Unless they have, like, the cure for cancer in them or something. Then you totally eat that rat. Yeah, even if where, you don't have also, cancer. Where do they get the rats? Is there a third party that takes care of the rats? I'm pretty sure they breed them. Like, I'm they pretty sure... They farms. Like, like, they take care of them themselves? The scientists? Yeah. They have they they host the farms. They don't. Oh no. That's what I meant. Like, is there a third party that they have like of people that raise rats? Yeah. And they give yeah, them to I'm the sure farm? there is. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Scientists yeah. are, do um, not make good mothers. So then it's up to those farmers or breeders rather to turn that into food, I guess. No, you. It wouldn't have to be them. I mean, well, breeders, they're the ones that are going to be selling it. Like, no, there like, could be a new market though. Yeah. So right. you get new breeders to start this? New farmers. Well, the uh, place where I had it, where I had rat, it was in, it, it was a place, and they bred their own rats there. Wait, you've eaten rat before? Right. Yeah. Where was this? China. How did it taste? It was good. See, I'm of the opinion that if it tastes good, like, who the fuck cares? It's not... Right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it, it's, it's very good. It's, I mean... Whew, it's also, a very it pale meat. It's also a good thing. It's actually it, it's actually one of the like healthier meats that you can eat. It, it's uh, it's not as fatty as you know red meat. So Emily asked us, "What do you want to do for lunch?" And I have the two options of why don't you make it for us, or let's get our own separately. Is our own me and Zach? Or... Uh, I, I think it's you going off and doing your own thing. Yeah, uh, I mean, it's like you're, you're backing out of then. this. I wasn't sure if I was out. asking her on a lunch date. Okay. Yeah, it sounds like it. All right, I, I can't wait to see how Emily's cooking is. Oh. Bad. For God's sake, I, God. I wonder where Thomas went. What? George has been astonished. looking for him all day. Do you think he left town? <laughs> That's the first time I've seen him shocked. The <laughs> family will not free him from his anxieties, and he knows it. I'm sure he is hiding away somewhere, just thinking things over. Think so? You don't know him that well. What makes you so sure? Uh -huh. My well, career focuses well, on finding people. You see, if you do cooking lessons with her, she actually, actually gets better. Actually, I need to change the oh, subject okay. and ask you something. What can I help you with? It's about the gravekeeper, Brian. But you don't care about that. About you mean I don't Brian care about Insomnia? forming relationships. Insomnia? You're not with her for her cooking, just that dress. He's working both day and night in the graveyard. <laughs> or what's beneath No him. one has ever seen him sleep. Oh, and that's why we oh, call him Brian the Insomniac. I heard that he owns That's why we call him Brian the Insomniac. <laughs> that's like there are also the, <laughs> the IT crowd. Always just in the graveyard. The guy that's like in the back room. Even for this town. Yep. What was his name? I see. Who knows? He is an insomniac. <laughs> We shouldn't have any trouble with the graveyard closing up then, Zach. Emily, thank you. <gasps> I've got to get going. That's their briefing room. Hey, York. I what? just finished getting everything ready. So oh, wait, yeah. what if I had taught her how to cook by we'll now? We'll lunch together soon, okay? Would it... I mean, would it be good for... Oh, she looked... Oh, hands on the hip. <laughs> she heard you say that. Zach, we can't take this. We should just flee. Holy shit. <laughs> Is that bad? Oh, man. Nope. Dude, you don't give a crap. Um, <laughs> look, right. like, look at how far away from her he's standing. Uh, <laughs> so, we are at an hour. Uh, I guess that's it. Yeah. Those hours come out quick. Yeah. yeah. Especially when you're talking about orgies. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thank you for joining me, guys. Thanks for having me. And hey, thank me. you for watching. See ya. Later. Bye.